We're with Jay Hokinson here, Lincoln County Emergency Management. Jay, you're from the north end of the county to the south end of the county watching this situation. We're here at Crow Creek, one of the tributaries. It's uh, still out here on a cool day, gushing out over the fields, but uh, Jay, bring us up to date on where we're at. We're, we're starting to see kind of a, a crest that happened over the weekend. It's weather driven. We're seeing the water kind of come down. And we'll see that for the next week, hopefully, kind of give us a break. And then uh, before the June high melt off, we can kind of reassess and see where we're at. This is one of the areas here in Crow Creek. You've been up looking at the tributaries coming out of Willow Creek, Strawberry Creek. Uh, Crow Creek seems to be uh, causing the most problems, and then specifically down in Cokeville, a lot of problems with groundwater. Give us a summary there. Yeah, the Smith Creek come in, and it's put a lot of water out in the fields. It created some groundwater that's flooded some homes. The town hall got some water in the basement of it, but we was able to go in and make some changes and get that water uh, under control. And back here in Star Valley, where do we stand? We're seeing we're seeing uh, lower levels of water that we've had reports of a lot of water in basements. Uh, people need to get pumps, continue to uh, work their subwater, make sure that it's safe there, be safe with their pets. But we're seeing kind of a break uh, in the real high water. Cooler temperatures this week, temperatures, daytime temperatures down in the 30s. Yeah, it's supposed to really cool off after today and Tuesday and Wednesday. We may get some snow Wednesday and then clear off and stay cool. And sandbagging opportunities to help out? Yeah, we have stations filled up in Thane, Road Bridge, and Athen Road Bridge to where people can help with the sandbagging efforts. Uh, all the equipment's there, and then uh, they can call our office for times so when they can donate their time, or if they need sandbags, they're available for property owners. And they can contact you through Lincoln County Dispatch? Correct. Thank you, Jay Hokinson, Lincoln County Emergency Management.